so it's uh, I don't know how to describe it man it's good stuff man oh, good man. all around all the musicians were some of the best studio players in town wow. I don't know why he asked me to come and play <laughs> but, <laughs> but he says nobody ever wants to know when, we, when he called other guitar players up they'd never come over on time and so I start hanging out down there with my guitar and my little bitty hundred dollar amp and uh we get better I get a better sound off this little hundred and twenty dollar Rollins. It's about the size of a cigar box. <laughs> <laughs> and it kicks butt. And Joe and plus they have a hundred thousand uh, dollars pro tools on their down at the studio. Mm-hmm. Ow. That's a huh. high do- that's the high dollar one. You know, and it's got effects out of effects out of effects out of I don't really like using a whole lot of effects when I play. Right. I do every now I'll I'll use something on the vocals occasionally and but I pr- I pretty much like the the next <clears throat> the next album that Cherokee Boys does not this one but the fi- the next one after this one I think I'm go- we're going back to the roots and going to do a live album. Oh um, wow. You know, just r- live live at a gig somewhere and <clears throat> hopefully it'll be a concert. And that's that's what I'm I'm planning on doing. We're going to start recording every, all of our shows and taking them back to the studio and seeing what we got. So and set up a YouTube channel. You need a YouTube channel. Well, I got to have some videos first. I mean, I got some, I have a bunch of videos, but they're terrible quality, man. Just the guys were moving the cameras around. And just, right. This guys I got out in the garage. They're pros. And he and I just got to come up with some bucks for him, and he's a, uh, you know. Another another really cool thing about Blog TV is if you upload a video or send it to me, yeah, um, we we can play it on the show. I don't and know, Deb. I don't know how. I have a video of yeah. of of um, the Voodoo Brothers. Would be some good. Would that be a show in itself? It's a whole hour. Oh wow! Wow. Uh, but the sound quality is not that good. It, it comes in and out, in and out. But the video itself is great. Look, it's clear. But I, I don't know. I just, I'd rather make a new one. I got a question here from a guy from uh, Dasperminator. <laughs> he says lots of guitar players have a hard time choosing between stomp boxes and processors. Well, here's my here's my answer to that. Use what makes you feel good, bro. I uh, I have a Roland's a GT6 that I use, and I only, it's got 385 effects in it, but I only use five of them. Wow! But I, I the the sound that I get is amazing. And then when I go in the studio, I don't use any effects. I play straight ahead and let those guys put the effects in afterwards. I have a old Fender concert head with a 412 cabinet and a Mesa boogie with a 112 that I use for my my main setup. And uh, I can I can adjust the volumes between the two of them, you know. Mm-hmm. And when you're running stereo out of that out of that uh, box I have out of the Rollins, it is just out of this world. You know, it just depends on where I'm playing. I can. I took this little amp and played a gig last Saturday night at VZDs here in Oklahoma City, and uh, <laughs> they put a little mic on it, and I played like that, and I was at a perfect volume. I sat. I didn't even sit on the stage with the guy. I sat right next to him. I was uh, sitting in, on the picnic table, right next to the stage. And they brought me a cheeseburger over and some fries and a, and an iced tea, and I sat there in between songs eating French fries. <laughs> <laughs> and they go, man, I, I could not believe the quality of that little ant, man. I got to get one of them. Said, yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> kind of like the little engine that could, huh? The little engine that could. And I, they actually got a little one over at over at Big Daddy Studio that I've used before. A little. 10 watt PV or something like that, or 15 watts, that I nailed some stuff on, man. And then Joe put these tube these tube things on it, 
made it sound like a tube amp. Oh my God, the sound is just incredible. I like to do a lot of experimentation in the studio if I have if I have the time. Oh, Matt, man, he uh, has an Ibanez emulator, plugs right into the board. Yeah, I, I I run mine right into the board too. There, Matt gets gets for gets a lot. It's a lot crisper sound than running through an amp. But uh, yeah, either way, either way will work, man. I like these guys are at least ask questions on here. You know it. Oh, uh, yeah. blog is so great. We love it here. Yeah. And JD, just so you know, uh, Desperminator, he is an incredible musician. Oh, I'm sure he is. I'm sure both these oh, guys he are. Is. He really is. And a really nice guy, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We love him. Well, why don't you play some of his music? Actually, play, you know what? Play, I, play one of his songs. I got. You want to hear it? I yeah. got the, I got the perfect thing. I'll, I'll I got two things for you, JD. I'm gonna play them both. Okay. Um, it's been all about JD, man. I like to share, man. I'm, I, uh, you know, I mean, I'm, I like to, I like my music, and I want my music to be heard. But you know what? Mm -hmm. I also like other people's music. <laughs> oh well, here so, you go. Okay. Meet, meet our friend Rob, also okay. known as Spermy. Okay. Spermy. This, this is what I'm gonna. <laughs> This is what I'm going to do. First thing, um, gives me a great opportunity to play the promo for a, our event coming up on the 1st of August. Oh, cool. Yeah, am I, am I involved in that marijuana thing? If you want to be. I definitely want to because I smoke it all the time. All right. Well, you know what? I, actually, what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to kick it off with like an hour, you know, of, oh. of my show. Mm -hmm. And most of it is going to be these guys coming on and playing live, you know, via webcam. But um, oh, every shoot. opportunity I get, I'm going to be playing music from all of you guys, too. Because I want you guys to be heard on there. Oh, yeah. All of you. Even if you can't play live, you're going to be heard. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. But we're, awesome. we're out to free the weed and turn people on to some of the most awesome music on the Internet. Mm -hmm. And some of the most awesome weed if it gets passed. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and I'm not condoning that kids smoke it, just people that are old enough. Responsible adults, and that's all we're yeah, talking and, and about. And no chihuahuas or boomeriners either. Right. Oh, well, you better have a talk with your boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was pooping buds for a month, wasn't he? <laughs> yeah. No, he's, he's, he's never gotten into it. But, uh, you want to sit him down and educate him about it and teach him the just say no stuff. Tell Roberta, <laughs> tell Roberta to leave the monkeys alone, all right? Okay. Roberta, We're not going there tonight. <laughs> We're not talking about the monkey and how he drowned. I'm sorry. Oh, you, you destroyed me that night. You were talking about the monkey. <laughs> yeah. And Deb was saying, Jack, make sure you All ask right, JD about it. Let's play this song. What's the name of the song, Jack? Okay, well, this one is the promo that we've got for. It's actually a video, JD. Um, oh, awesome! That's great, man. It's um, it's it's about it's for our event, um, about on August first, about freeing the weed, and then afterwards, the song I'm going to play is called "Out for Blood." Okay, is All this right? a two-hour show tonight or an hour? It can be as long as we want it to be. We have no time limits over here. We can go all night. Oh well, we've got yeah. ten viewers. How about them monkeys, she says again. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, it's actually about promoting the medical use of the stuff. Well, uh... At the minimum, but Let honestly, me tell you something, man. I, I have cirrhosis of the liver, people. Yes, I used to drink too much Jack Daniels, okay? But here's the deal. Every time... They want to give me morphine, okay? Morphine is addicting as a mother... Mm -hmm. Yeah, marijuana helps ease the pain in my abdomen. It really, really does. They don't believe me. They will not ever believe me because it's the the damn Veterans Administration, you know. But let me tell you something. I'd rather smoke marijuana and not get a liver than do morphine and be strung out because right. that is the that's the worst <laughs> stuff to kick, man. Yeah. Okay. It's it's worse than even crystal meth. Once you're on it, that's why. That's how stupid our government is. I hate to say Amen. it. They'd rather get people strung out than do the right thing and just legalize marijuana. If they legalize marijuana, we could pay off the national debt in five years. Thank you. Yeah.
JD, let me let me yes. throw let me throw. All a right, statistic. put it on, bro. Now hold on, let me throw a statistic at you while we're talking about this. 